Hey everybody, Jason from Trendify here, and today I'm going to talk to you about how to use the high-level social media posting tool and AI that's built into high-level to get clients extremely quickly and start covering your monthly expenses with high-level so that then you're free. If you've watched any of my past videos, you know that my goal for you is to get your expenses covered as fast as possible. Because once you do, then you can decide to pick a niche, then you can decide to work on your own businesses, whatever you want to do to expand, but you don't have the pressure of this overhead of your company. And what I love about High Level is again, they let you do what's called white labeling. They allow you to use your name and your brand, but leverage their technology. They've built the software. You can put your own brand on top of it and sell it for whatever you want to as many people as you want. The example I always use is if Netflix would allow me to rebrand it as Jason Flicks and start selling it to all my friends and family and everyone around the world at whatever price I want, but Netflix just maintains the, the programming and everything behind the scenes, but I get to sell this as my own company, which is awesome. I can't express how awesome it is that they allowed it, you to do that. But with this tool today, I'm going to show you how to get clients very quickly because that's the most important thing. So we do have a free 30 day trial right here at ghlfree.com. That's my link. You'll see my face on there. And as soon as you click that, you'll get a free 30 day trial to high level. If at any point during your 30 days, you want to downgrade to either the 297 per month plan or even the 97 per month plan, you can totally do that. And I've heard in some circumstances, if you reach out to high level, they will also extend that free trial, but I can't guarantee that because they're always changing their rules uh, and who knows if they'll offer that at the time that you do it but I have heard of a lot of people doing it so give it a shot if you want to now what I want to share with you today is what I think is one of the most underutilized tools inside of high level and that is the social media posting tool I'm going to show you how I go out and find clients how I actually can set up that tool for them I'll show you what other companies are charging so you can get some confidence that people would be willing to pay you for this service and I'll show you how to actually use the posting tool inside of here with AI with chat GPT built into high level to make your job extremely easy so let's get into that so here I am on a a page that I've mentioned in previous videos. This is just one of many companies that offer automated social media posting for consumers and business owners. And you can see what they offer in their plans here. For $99 per month, they do three unique posts per week, up to two social media platforms included. So three posts per week on two platforms. High Level offers posting unlimited, which you can do through your own branded high level account. You can offer unlimited posting and you can offer it on multiple different platforms. So high level currently does Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, Twitter, TikTok, and Google. And soon they were also going to have the Instagram reels and stories, which I think is just a few weeks away. By the time you're watching this, it might already be out, which is I think the full package. The only thing that would be missing potentially is YouTube down the road, but most people aren't worried about posting on YouTube in the small business arena. They're looking at Facebook, LinkedIn, uh, maybe some, some uh, TikTok if they're trying to be a little more tech savvy, but $99 per month is what they're offering. Then you can see the next plan is 195. That's five posts per week four social media platforms, and then it goes up from there. Most people on high level are either on the $497 per month plan or the $297 per month plan. And just with a couple clients, even at this, or even if you decided to offer a little bit more, you could have your expenses covered. And it's a very easy foot in the door strategy that everyone understands before you start offering chat widgets and reviews and all that stuff, which I think is incredible and business owners definitely should take advantage of, but it's a little bit harder to get them to understand they need that if they don't have it already. But everyone knows that they need to be posting more on social media and they don't want to do it. Okay, they want somebody to do it at an extremely affordable rate, and now you can offer that to them with your high-level posting tool. So let's get into the actual posting tool. I'll show you how to set it up, and I'll show you the new content AI generator inside of it, so you can see how easy it would be to come up with posts for a potential client. Okay, here we are inside of the social media posting tool, and I wanna show you how easy it is to set up posts schedule them, move them around, all that stuff. So all we have to do once we connect our accounts here, and again, we can do Facebook, LinkedIn, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, Google, all those things we can connect in here. And once we do it for a client, we never have to log into their social media platforms again. Everything is inside of our dashboard, inside of that particular client's sub account. 
So the way it works is you get a new client onboarded, you set them up with their own account, and then all of their social media is connected to that one account. Nobody else, none of your other clients see their posts or anything like that. They can have a login or not have a login using this method either way, but you have control over this to be able to post on their profiles without ever bothering them again for logins or any of that stuff. So once all that is connected, then all we have to do is click new post. And again, if we go to that smart comms, there was three posts per week on two accounts, right? But you can see here, I have all these different groups and Instagram accounts and everything connected for this particular profile. And if I just click new post here, I can do create new post. And that will allow me to pick all the platforms that I want to post on. You can see how easy it would be to post on all the platforms at the same time. Or maybe you wanted to post certain things on Instagram and certain things on Twitter, th certain things on TikTok. You can do all that very quickly inside of here. But let's just for this example, click on this Facebook page. That's all we're going to do. Now, what we can do, you can see this little content AI thing. So maybe I have the client and I'm just stuck. I don't know what to post for them. So what I can do here is I can just do content AI, click this and say, I want to do real estate in, let's do Dallas, Texas, right? A few posts about the Dallas, Texas real estate market. And then keywords, we can do Dallas. And then you can select a writing tone. So it could be funny, casual, maybe you have somebody that does luxury for this example and you want it to be professional. Number of variations, you can do as many as you want. Let's do three and we'll click generate. And we just wait a few seconds for the magic behind the scenes. It pulls in information from ChatGPT. I believe they're using version three or 3.5 right now, but it doesn't really matter. It's just generating some basic content for you that you can either use off the bat or you can go in and use it as a base to add even more to it. Let's scroll through and just see some examples. And this is obviously on the fly, so who knows what we'll get. So the real estate market in Dallas, Texas is booming with a variety of homes and prices to fit your budget. Now is the perfect time to explore the Dallas real estate market. And then it gives you some hashtags here. So here's another example and another example. Say I didn't like any of these. I can just hit generate new content and it will generate three brand new posts for me. And I could probably get even better with what's called prompting, which is the information that I put in on the front end. But I just wanted to show you a very quick example. So say I wanted to use this one. All I do is click copy. And then now it copies it over to this area here. I can add to it if I want or if I just like the way it is, then I can click continue and it already fills it in for this post. Now from here, I can add videos, I can add images. I'm gonna show you where to get great images in a moment, but say this is all I wanted to do for maybe a tweet. I could do this right here, click post, and it would be posted on my client's profile. Or I can do this, which is schedule post, which is really cool. And I can schedule it for Friday at 10 a.m. Click schedule post. Now, what I love about this is if I click the open planner button here, you can see that here is that post that I scheduled here. And what I love about this is it allows you to easily reschedule these posts wherever you want. Say I've promised this client three posts per week. If I wasn't doing this video, it probably would have taken me 10 seconds to generate that content. And if I wanted to just see, I promised them three posts. So one, two, three, maybe I need to move this one around to next week. I already had four this week, for example. I just move it. Every time I redrag it to a different place, it reschedules it for that day, which makes it super easy. If I was doing this on all the different platforms manually, I'd have to log into Twitter, log into TikTok, log into Instagram, all these different places and reschedule it on those platforms. Here, I just drag it over wherever I want and it will reschedule to that particular day. So that is cool by itself. Now let's go do another one. Say I promised them three posts this week. I only have one. So I need to go back and hit this back button and click new post. And here let's try the content AI. So that's where you go to get that again. So I'm gonna show you now where to get some really awesome images to pull in here and make it even easier for you to create content. All right, here we are inside of Canva and I use Canva every single day. I even have a library of templates I'll show you here. Any of my affiliates get this for real estate. It's an entire library of a ton of different real estate templates that my team has designed. You can use these to resell or you can even use them for your own clients to post on their particular platform. Where I created most of these is inside of this Canva platform. And all you have to do, say you're working with a real estate agent, is you can just do real estate, click search, and you can see a massive library of posts that you can just pull from. Now you can't resell these if they're Canva designed, but you can use these to post on your client's accounts, which is really cool. Let's say I wanted to do this one. So it pulls it up, it shows me the home buying process in seven steps. Here's a cool graphic. 
You can edit this, so customize this template. And then now that we're here, you can see it has at really great sites. You could change that to Susie Sells Denver. Maybe that's her handle. We can make that bold. And you can see how easy this is to edit. You can change the background, you can change what the text is, all this stuff. You could probably change colors. Yep, change that to maybe that particular client's colors are all purple. And then all we do from here, once we have this image, is we click share and download. And this will download to our computer. And then we can upload it to high level inside of that client's dashboard and we can use it again. Now, maybe I wanted to remove this so I could use this for every client that I had that was a real estate agent. So I could download this without any branding on it and I can use that as a library that I pull from for my 10 or 50 or 100 real estate clients. And you can do the same thing with plumbers and roofers and anybody else that you wanna do this for. So that's where we actually go to get the imagery that we wanna post on social media. Now, let's go back to our high level account and I'll show you how to generate some AI content for this post and actually get it posted. Okay, here we are back inside of high level and we're going to do new post and I'm going to do content AI. I'm going to do home buying process, discuss the home buying in fun detail. Home buying and then funny, generate, let's see what we get. Okay, so we have, are you ready to take the plunge and buy a home? Don't worry, we make a home buying process fun. Let's dive in and explore all the exciting steps to buying a house. You never know what surprises await home buying. So, I mean, they're kind of corny, a little cheesy, but for the most part, you're just getting some good content out there and you can use this as a baseline to edit and add on top of that. But let's just pick one of these, copy, continue. Now we generated that image in Canva. So that was something we could pull in here. So we hit this upload file. We're going to find it on our computer, which is this one we just uploaded. Here it is. We double click it. And now that image is, oh, I need to select an account. So let's say it's here. Now we have the entire post, the image, everything in here. Obviously this is just a demo example. So I would have fixed these colors and you can see it's a little scrunched down in here, but don't worry when you actually post it, it will not have that. It'll actually retain its square image and they are working on that, but it doesn't really matter. It, it fixes no problem. So you can save for later or you can post now. You can schedule the post or you can send it out to a client for approval, which is really cool too. I don't do a ton of this because I charge such low prices that my clients know once they approve just the general concept of what type of content I'm going to be posting, they don't care about checking every single post and approving it. It just takes too much time and creates a bottleneck in my opinion, but you can do it if you want to. So let's schedule the post for Thursday, schedule post, and then I'll go back to my planner and I'll see that I have a post here and here, but I, I meant to post it here. So we just drag it over. And now we have two of the three posts that we promised them for the week. So you can see doing this, we can actually generate these posts in a matter of seconds. They're really great quality compared to what an agent is normally posting or any other small business. They're typically, typically posting some really crappy images that aren't going to be very effective. So this is an extremely effective way to provide a great service at a great price and doesn't require a lot of work on your part. I could get this entire month at three posts a week or five posts a week. I could get it done in probably 30 minutes if I wasn't creating this video on top of it, probably even less. And once you have a library of templates, then it's just putting them all in different places. And if you have 10 real estate clients or 100 real estate clients, it just makes it very formulaic where I can, at the beginning of every month, schedule everyone's post and I'm done. It probably would take me just one day to do 20 clients uh, dashboard. So now let me talk to you about how to actually go and get clients, some strategies that you might not have thought of. Okay, here I am on one of my Instagram accounts. I have multiple different Instagram accounts in every kind of niche you can think of. And one of my favorite ways to actually find clients is through Instagram. And what I do is I start a local city centric account because I do a lot of localized marketing. So uh, I might find everything around a certain city. I don't particularly stick with one niche. I used to, but I found that I like to be freer to move around to different industries and niches. You can do whatever you want. The same strategy would work if you wanted to only focus on plumbers, for example, or med spas. You can do the same overall concept idea, but this is what I've done. So I created this account, Katie Network. I live in a city called Katie, Texas. And I created this account 
And what I've been doing is going and finding people that have raised their hand saying that they live in this city and they're a business owner. My thought process of why I did this is I went and found all the people that follow the Katy Chamber of Commerce, which if you're not in the States or not in the US, you may not know that a Chamber of Commerce is where local businesses will go and meet and talk about what's going on in the local city and try to get business. It's kind of a networking thing as well. I found that if people are liking and following the Chamber of Commerce in my city, then they're likely a business owner in Katy, Texas. So, and then all I do is I go and find all the people following the Katie Chamber and I start following and engaging with those people. I follow maybe 10, 20, 30 a day. I engage with them. I check out what their business is. And if I see that they haven't posted in a few weeks, then I might send them a DM and say, hey, would you be open to me doing free social media posting for you for for a week or two weeks? If you like it, then we can talk about what that would cost moving forward. I make it extremely affordable for you. I guarantee you're gonna get some yeses or at least some tell me mores. So what we do is, I wanna show you my account again too. So one thing you'll notice is it doesn't say my name, it doesn't say Trendify, it doesn't say anything other than showcasing the entrepreneurs, business owners, creators, and doers in Katy, Texas. So when somebody comes across this account, after I follow them, they're gonna see that this says, I love Katy. It's going to say it's showcasing entrepreneurs and business owners, so everyone wants to promote their business and their brand at a very easy rate. They're likely to follow me back. If I engage with them, I leave a meaningful comment on some of their posts, I don't instantly try to spam them with, with a pitch, then, I find that I get a lot of followers back. Once you get a few hundred or even a few thousand followers here, it just starts snowballing really, really quickly. I find that this is a very easy way to go out and start networking with people and pitching your product over the DMs. Another way that I would do this is on Facebook, and that is something you can do even quicker. So let me take you to Facebook and I'll show you what I would do. All right, so here we are in Facebook, and this is a strategy that I say proceed with caution and don't overdo it, but I do want to let you know that a great gold mine of finding clients is in these buy, sell, trade groups because it's a lot of people that own businesses, a lot of people that know business owners. So what you can do is go in here and the common mistake I see a lot of people make is they try to be way too corporate -y. They try to make their business sound like it's this multi-billion dollar brand and you can get a lot more clients by just being honest and telling them the truth and saying that you're just starting your new marketing company. You're trying to get some clients for free and what you're going to offer doing. So let's try something like I'm... Okay, so something to this effect. Uh, I just started a new marketing company. I'm looking for a few local businesses that I can do social media posting for free for the next 14 days. Let me know if you're interested. Something like this, very generic. You can be honest, let them know that you're new. This is a new company for you. And the reason we're talking about a 14 day free trial, you'll start seeing the flood works come in of interested, tell me more, let me know. You can also do this if you don't wanna do it inside of these buy, sell trade groups, you can do it just on your main Facebook profile. And you'll start getting some people tagging other people, let me know, you probably get some family members or extended family that raise their hand and say, yeah, I'm interested. And all you do then is once you talk to them, you say, I'm willing to do posting for you for the next 14 days or the next seven days or whatever you're comfortable doing. After that, it's just 97 bucks per month or 197 per, per month or whatever you want to charge. And you can say, if you don't like it at the end of the trial, no problem. You can keep all the posts I've already done for you and you don't have to pay anything. If you do want me to keep doing it, then it'll be extremely affordable and I'll keep doing it. No contracts, nothing like that. You can just do it month to month. And if you ever want to quit, just let me know and we'll stop posting for you. And it's a very easy foot in the door strategy. You'll find a lot of people that say, yes, I promise. So use this in conjunction with the Instagram longer term strategy, but that will snowball. That will be a lot bigger strategy once you get it going. Uh, those two combined, you can do for free. You don't have to run paid ads or anything like that. And you can get this up to 10, 20, 50 clients just by doing this. I talk about so many other ways that you can make money with high level as well, but this is something that you could do literally today and start getting some clients without having to pitch like email marketing and getting reviews and all that stuff. Those are things you can add on once you get these clients in your world, then you can start adding on those other services too once you get more comfortable with how to use them. But everyone knows what social media is, they know they need to do it more and they don't wanna do it themselves. I find that time and time again. So use this strategy, see if it works for you and I promise you, you will start getting some clients very quickly. And lastly, I just wanna remind you, take advantage of that free 30 day trial down below. I'll help you as much as I can I do Q&A sessions in my group, which you can join as well. And I hope that you guys get some value out of these trainings. Make sure you hit the like button. That lets YouTube and me know that you like this type of content and allows me to keep putting this out for free for you. And with that, I'll see you on the next video. Thanks so much.